what's going on guys switch through here and welcome back to another youtube video so in this youtube video what i'm going to be showing you how to do is install themes directly from the nx themes install a homebrew application directly to your switch without using a computer so the first thing that you'll want to do is you'll want to jump on into nx themes installer but what you're going to need to do is run this in full me memory mode so to run the application in full memory mode what you want to do is hold r and launch any game so what i'm going to do is launch pokemon violet and as you can see because you're holding r what it's going to do is load up the hb menu so from here what you want to do is go to the nx themes installer app and click a on it and launch the following application what you then want to do is you want to scroll down to download themes and you want to leave it on this screen for now. So what we're going to do is jump over onto the PC and we're going to go and grab a theme ID so we can input it into the following text box. So what I'm going to do is jump over onto the computer and show you guys what to do from here. And just to let you know, as you could see before I went into the application, I have removed my current theme so you guys can fully see what I'm doing in the following video. So what we're going to do now, like I said, is we're going to jump over onto the computer and go grab a theme ID. So I'll see you on the computer, guys. So guys, once you're over on your computer, what you want to do is go ahead and launch your internet browser. And what you want to do is search for Themesa. As you can see, I've got it here. And what you want to do is go onto the Themesa website. Once you're on the Themesa website, you guys may have to create an account to be able to download the following theme of your choice. As you can see, I have already got an account. So once you're on here, what you can do is go ahead and go to Packs and these are the following themes that people have uh, what people have created um you can also search a theme by name or search by the creator for example so what i'm going to do here is i'm going to search for patterns and as you can see we have got the following patterns theme here which i wish to install so what i'm going to do is go ahead and click on the following theme and as you can see here, we have got a theme ID number, which is P59B. So this is the following code that we're going to need to input on the Nintendo Switch console. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to head over back onto my Nintendo Switch. And this is the following code that I'm going to be entering. So what I'll do now, guys, is switch back onto my Nintendo Switch and show you guys what to do from there. So guys, as you can see, we're now back over on the Nintendo Switch console. And what we're going to do is we're going to go down to the following input text box here. And we're going to search for the theme ID. So the theme ID, what I chose was P59 and B. I'm then going to go ahead and click the plus button, which is the OK button. And I'm going to go ahead and click search. And as you can see, guys, once it's done the search, it has now found the patterns theme that I wish to install. So what I'm going to do is down at the right hand side, I'm going to click A on the download all button. And what it's going to do is download the theme package. Once it's completed, you just want to go ahead and click OK. You then want to push left on your left analog stick and go up to themes and as you can see here we've got the patterns theme installed so what you can go ahead and do is you can either go down each file individually and install them one by one by clicking a on each one or you can go ahead and click the y button and scroll down and click a on each one and it's going to highlight them all in red you can then go ahead and click the plus button which is going to install each theme so what i'm going to do now is wait for these to install Once they've installed, guys, what you're going to need to do is you're going to need to reboot your Switch console. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to go ahead and reboot the console. I'll then power it back on and boot back into Atmosphere. And I'll show you guys that the theme has now been applied. As you can see now, guys, the Nintendo Switch has rebooted and I'm back at the Switch dashboard. And you can see that the new custom theme has been installed and applied to the console.
so yeah guys this is just a quick video on how to install themes directly from the nx themes installer app rather than using your computer i'd like to thank you guys for watching the video and i'll see you in the next one peace